Welcome back to another video. I'm Abdullah Chatmachi. I'm a street photographer here in the UK. Uh, today we'll be shooting with the Leica Q2 here in wonderful city of Plymouth. Probably the first time I'm here in Plymouth doing street photography. So it um, seems quite busy. We're going to see what we can capture in today's video and see what you guys like the images from today's video. So further ado, let's get at it with the Leica Q2 baby in Plymouth, UK. So here are my settings, shutter speeds 1 500th of a second or 1 250th of a second, f-stop between f8 and f11, auto ISO and my focusing is uh, zone focusing which I'll explain in a future video in more detail and that's my settings. <laughs> yeah, I already have, I already have. <laughs> Thank you. 
sorry mate, Here are my top three images in today's video. In no specific order, we'll start off with this two women, one in orange and red and one in blue. I personally like this. I think they're just a matching couple. Maybe they are a couple, I don't know, but they they really stand out. One's really colorful in orange and red. One of them's blue and blonde. Um, I really like the shop mainly because of the clothing that they're wearing and the woman's hairstyle matching her top really on the right hand side. I think it's a good shot mainly because of the people that's in the shot other than the frame in the background. If it was probably a different background it would probably have been different but it's just I like the way that the two women are dressed. I think the colours just pop in the shot. So we'll move on to the next shot. Yeah, so on to this shot. This is a more of a portrait style shot. I don't normally do it when I'm doing street photography. Quite rare I do a portrait style shot. Um, yeah, I really like the colours. I think it's just matching with his scooter and bag with the British Heart Foundation shop in the background. Um, and just the highlight and shadow part of it. I really like it. And plus his blue jacket, which makes it pop out of the rest. So it really stands out in this shot. Caught him in the corner of my eye, and I, I wanted to take a picture of him before he rides off. So, yeah, really good shot. I really like it, mainly because of the colour and the highlights and shadows. I think this is just the perfect one. So, uh, on to the next one and last one. Yeah, this is probably the best shot out of the whole lot, really, personally for me. I like the women's facial expressions. And uh, the guy drinking his Coke Zero drink and plus the red, the red and the yellows, they just match. I don't know why I do this. I seem to match colors quite well when I'm doing street photography. I think it's just, it's just crazy. I don't notice it at the time. I just see uh, people and I just capture the shot really. But in this one, I didn't put it to my eye. I done it from hip, which I don't normally do really. I normally shoot from eye level view. But on the hip, sometimes, occasionally, I would shoot it. But because I wanted to get quite close and they were just in their own little bubble and I just want to capture something really good. And I like the guy in the wheelchair minding his own business. I think the framing's perfect in this shot. It's one of my favourites, personal favourites. 
if you have a different top three than my top three images let me know in the comment section below i would like to hear what your favorites are or what you don't like from the video or what you, i should have done differently or what you would like to see me do something in the future but that's my style of street photography is candid street portraits i like to be candid it's not everyone's cup of tea but it's my style um catch you guys in the next video so uh peace out